hey guys welcome back to the channel on today's video i have a quick project share to share with you guys i am so excited about this project i think they turned out so cute you guys and i cannot wait to share with you what i used and how i came about creating these super cute super girly pastel witches cauldrons and the little witch legs sticking out i think they came out adorable and you guys i'm just gonna show you what they look like look at these super cute little memory dex cards i think these are super fun to share on halloween mail and look at the little legs i absolutely love it i use a combination of papers which i'm going to show you guys in a few but look at these cards there's stitching oh my gosh i don't even know how i'm gonna part with these they are so cute so i did two with the little witch's legs and then two just plain cauldrons that look like this and let me get into what I used. So these are a cut file. I am going to have it linked down below. It's from the Silhouette Design Store. And the file I think comes with the cauldron and all the little bits and pieces like the witch legs, the little, like the drip right here. I'm trying to think what else. The stockings. And I think it has belt buckles as well, but I wanted to do glitter. So I didn't use the belt buckles. And it has the little handle such a cute file you guys you must check it out i absolutely love it this is kind of like what the collagen looks like what i did was cut um a bunch of different cutouts and then i like cut off the legs and changed the legs and did double layering so that's what i did on a few of them and the paper that i used is this paper by cartabella which is the farmhouse collection i think it's called let me see i have it up here on my computer it's home again and i'm gonna have it linked down below so you guys can check it out the black cardstock and the pink cardstock paper is from michael's the word phrases are from serena b's spooky pastel i think sticker sheet those are the little word phrases i think they went perfect i did do some backing so this is just pink and then i backed it with the black cardstock my little spiders are from this little sequence pack that i got in my embellishment boxes from christina i also used the enamel dots that she sent me put those there and then i used some of these to put on the handles of the cauldrons or cauldrons i never know how to pronounce that word but i used some of these and these are from michael's and then the little ghosties are a die cut that i have i'll have the die the little ghost die linked down below so you guys can check that out that's from aliexpress but you guys, I am obsessed and I think it turned out super cute. As far as the little glitter part, I just did some, what did I do? I'm trying to think what that's called. Hold on one second. Let's see. Oh, I used some Mod Podge and then I just put a little bit on the little feet and then I used the glitter from my Paper Cherries kit from last month because it's very fine black glitter. And you guys, I am obsessed. And I did some stitching. So what I did as far as to add the memory dex card, I made this myself. I did the little cutout. There's no piece that I added through the Cricut machine. I hand did that part. I just cut out a little piece and then just put it in between the two sheets because there's two layers. And then I stitched it on together. And that's how I made it. A memory dex card. I did that with all of them. They're super sturdy because I did use super sturdy cardstock to back them up just so that they can last you always want to send a memory dex card that's not so flimsy i did also use uh wing costella on the drip i'm not sure if you can see that there you go so there is a little bit of shine and oh my gosh you guys i love it i didn't use the little stocking cutout on this one because since it had a plaid it kind of looks like like the plaid pattern it kind of looks like if she's got stockings on so I like the way that one looked and I didn't use the little cutouts for the stocking. And look, you guys, they look so cute. You guys have to let me know down below what you think. I think they're adorable. I absolutely love them. I think it's the cutest pastel project I've done yet. The little ghosties, I put them right here and I did some little cute little jemmy eyes on them. And then I did little ghosties over here where I kind of like hooked his little ghost tail onto the little handle. And then there's a little ghost back here. 
I can't even deal. I think they turned out so cute. And yeah, that's it for this video, you guys. It's a super quick project share. I just wanted to show you guys what they look like and how I made them. They're super easy. Any of you guys can make them and share them for Halloween. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you. And I will catch you on the next video. Bye, guys.